I was having a conversation with my tutor a few months ago. We were talking about how evil humanity was, and how vile we have made this world to be. Everything from death, destruction, exploitation, rape, genocide, oppression, slavery, and sin. We analyzed every subject, turning them inside out, talking our mouths dry, picking apart certain situations and events that have unfolded in this world. But in the middle of the conversation, he stopped and looked at me, sensing some sort of anxiety-laced depression hanging a noose around my neck. He said in an attempt to console me, first that ignorance is bliss, and that opening your eyes to the world hurts when you see the truth of the matter. Second, he told me that despite the abundance of hate in this world, there will always be goodness and love. And third, he said that though there may be only a slim possibility that an individual will change this world with purpose and with benevolence by opening the minds of a soul in humanity, that I should still try to because it's the right thing to do. It's my obligation to myself, my world, and my values that I try regardless of what looks to bear down upon me. And it's a waste of my ability if I don't. As I left, I couldn't help but be drowned out with depression, contemplating what a dust speck of insignificance my hopes compared to. I felt powerless and pessimistic and began to question how people could even be capable of doing the things they did. And I was numb from shock. But I soon started to realize more and more the meaning of my tutor's message. It started to sound a whole lot like an idea of faith. Being an agnostic, I had never acknowledged this world before, and did not want to, but it crept into my heart and mind with a purpose and a place, and sounded just like this. Faith is how I cope with my sadness. It's how I cope with my cynicism and my despair. It's what keeps me from going crazy at times. It makes me have hope for the tiny, malnourished chance that maybe people will display some sort of goodness. It's what keeps me working towards my ambitions, and what gives me purpose for the present and the future. It stands contrary to everything crude and horrible in this world. It's a tool of empowerment. It's a motivator. And it needs neither facts nor reason to inspire hope in an individual. Even in a little bitch like Tom Cruise, 